Hey, it's Mark. In this video, I'm going to show you how to blur out your house or a person or other objects in Google Maps. You can't do this on an Android phone, so we're going to hop over to desktop and I'll show you how to do it there. So on desktop, you go to maps.google.com or google.com slash maps and you can get there. So I'm on a Google map of Beverly Hills and let's say you're a celebrity like Elvis Presley if he were still alive. You could go in, you could type in your address here. Um, Let's see, He's, he lived on 1174 Hillcrest Road in Beverly Hills. So you go to that location, and then you're gonna to wanna to go to Street View. So to go to Street View, you can either click on the little image down here on the bottom, or you can take the little yellow person or alien, whatever it is, and then drag it and just drop it right in front of that house. So um, this is 1174 North Hillcrest Road, Beverly Hills. It looks like someone has already blurred out Elvis's house on Google Maps. Um, but let's say you're this guy right here, and one day you were trimming the hedges in front of the house, and you're like, hey, I have another job. I'm also a musician. I play at the piano bar. I don't want people to know that I also trim the hedges at Elvis Presley's house, whatever it might be, because these streetcars... Um, from Google, they drive by and take pictures of everything. Maybe you don't want your picture on Google Maps, or maybe you don't want your house on Google Maps. Um, so to do that, you go down in the bottom right, there's this tiny little text. They always do that. They hide the text when they don't want you to find it. It says, report a problem, right there. And you click on that, and then you can see here, uh, this is the image that I had on my screen. So it says, what would you like to blur? Um, and you can adjust the, the view here, uh, there. So I want to blur out this guy. Let's say this is me. Um, and it could say, what would you like us to blur? And you could say a different object. Um, and I'll say a person trimming the hedges. Whatever you want. Um, Google's going to review this and they may or may not blur it out. But for your privacy or privacy, however you want to say it, you can blur stuff out. And then what's wrong with this um, image? Uh, misplaced image, no, I don't know. I'll try to leave it blank and then put in my email address here um, and use reCAPTCHA. And by the way, did you know reCAPTCHA was invented by the same guy that created Duolingo, the popular language app? Yeah, fun fact there. But then you click Submit and it says, thanks, we've received your report. Um, if they find this image in violation of the, any of their policies, they'll email us. Um, we'll see what happens. Um, leave us a comment if you have a question or put a question, whatever you want. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. That's how you blur out an image, a house, whatever it might be. You could put your license plate. If you don't want to get robbed and you don't want people to see certain entryways to your house, that's fine. Your privacy is your privacy. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.